haul will be a fall makeup haul. So I have been going crazy when it comes to buying makeup. I don't know why, but I have I have really been into the dark lipsticks. So today I will show you lipsticks, eyeshadows, blushes, foundations, so many things that I have purchased that I just really wanted to show you guys. So let's get to the video. So the first things first is has to be foundation, hands down foundation. So I have found the perfect foundation for me. Recently, like like some months ago, I purchased the Revlon Color Shapes and Cappuccino and I did not like it. And the only reason why I bought it was because of YouTube. You know, because YouTube can suck you in. I mean suck you in. And I bought it because a lot of people were raving about it and how good it was, but I bought it. And it did nothing for my skin because I have oily and dry skin all together. So when I put it on, it looked like I had a grease bucket on my face. So I had to change it. I actually gave that away. And so the foundation that I got was from CVS Pharmacy because they gave me a $10 store credit. So at that time, I was really trying to find a foundation, and I actually I did, and this is the foundation right here. It is Black Radiance Foundation. It is in the color Perfection Oil Free Liquid Makeup from Black Radiance, and my color is 8416 Mocha Honey. So as you can see right there, I really like, I love this foundation. Not only because it's good and it's oil free, so it does not have my face looking oily out throughout the day. But it has this little wand here, so all you have to do is put the little dots right here and get your foundation brush and keep it moving. But this is the foundation that I love, and this is the foundation that I'm going to be sticking with. So you can find these at CVS Pharmacy, Walgreens, Walmart, Target. So go check it out. So next has to be found, not foundation, next has to be eyeshadow. Get a little tongue tied here. So I went to Ulta, and they had these foundations. You know, the Naked Palette, the Naked Palette 1 and 2. Them suckers was $41 plus tax. I wasn't about to buy that. So Walgreens has the dupe for each set. So there were $5. So that is what I picked up and I'm going to show you. And it's called Bear. Yeah, it's called Bear. This is, it. This is a package right here. And it's 10 colors. And look, it looks just like this. It has, um, this is the bare one, so it has all the glitter and then the um, matte colors right here. And this is what I use today on my eyes. I don't know if y'all can see it, but this is what I used today. And the next palette that I got is the smoky one. And the smoky one has all these beautiful colors. As you can see right here, I have not used this palette, but I am so anxious to use it because they have some wonderful colors in here. But if you are looking for a dupe palette for the Naked, the Naked 1 and the Naked 2, go get these. They're at Walgreens for $5. Um, they are from Pro Fusion. So go get these. They probably, they look just the same as the Naked palette. That's just probably... A different quality I don't know because I never tried the naked but I would go try these before I go spend $45 plus tax on the Dura Naked palette that's just my opinion so next I will talk about blushes um, I have seen a lot of people on YouTube like black is beautiful and African export they have been talking about um, these blushes and I actually saw them and I picked them up so the first one has to be from black radiance and it's warm berry I will show you that right here it's warm berry and I actually wearing this today on my cheeks as you can see but yeah this is warm berry and I love this I like how it looks on me looks like a fresh coat of mm. so that's that right here and the next one is toasted almond and I wore this the other day and I loved it I love that these blushes actually fit 
for chocolate girls and it actually enhances my beauty because you know I'm already beautiful but actually give me that enhancing and the next one and these are excuse me I'm talking too fast but the black um, radiance eyeshadows not eyeshadows the black is black radiance blushes are actually $4.99 you can get them at Walmart Kmart Walgreens, not Walgreens, CVS Pharmacy, I know sells them. So yeah, these are the Black Radiance Toast Baked Blushes. And I know Elf, they have some baked blushes also, and this is the one I got for 2 or $3. And here it is right here, and um, I don't know, but it is, the name of it is Rich Rose. So, this is the blush that I got right here. And I like it. I like that the gold and then the pink and the orange. But those are the blushes that I purchased. So next, I'm going on to makeup. And FYI, I have a lot of lipsticks. So bear with me. So the lipsticks that I have on today is it's from Kate from Rimla from Rimmel. But it's the Kate lip, the Kate lipstick, and I love her lipsticks because I have actually have this is my third lipstick that I got from her, and I love her lipsticks because even if you don't put any lip gloss or lip balm under your lips, it still gives you that moisturize. It still moisturizes your lips. So if any time that I'm wearing a lipstick, I am using a moisturizer, and the lip balm that I use to moisturize my lips before I put on a Lip balm is the Burt's and Bees. I used to use the Carmets, but I divorced Carmets and Burt's and Bees is now my husband. So that is the lips, lip balm that I use. And this is the lipstick that I'm wearing now. And I do not know the name of this lipstick, but it is the balm. And it is 107. That's the number. And so, the next brand of lipsticks that I'm going to talk to you about has to be my all-time favorite. If I'm ever going into the store looking for lipstick, this is the brand that I go to first. And that has to be Revlon. I have watched so many YouTubers talk about Revlon, and that's how I got hooked, is watching Black is Beautiful. And she was showing us her, you know, her lipstick collection so I had to go out and get some of this lipstick just because we're watching her video so the first lipstick that I got from Revlon is black cherry it is 477 and it looks like this I love this lipstick oh my god I love it and I used to didn't even like dark lipsticks I always stick with the nudes and the pinks but I have evolved into a better me. And the next one is lipsticks has to be CoverGirl. Also I have some CoverGirl lipsticks and these are the Queen Collection and this one is Ruby Slipper. And it looks like this. I really like the red in it. Also I'm following Ruby Slipper by Red Plum. And red plum looks like this. And also fine wine. And I like fine wine. So those are my cover lipsticks. So I'm going to take you to Maybelline. I have a Maybelline lipstick as well. And it's called Bit of Berry. And it looks just like this. So my last lipsticks that I'm going to be showing you is from Milani. I have, I went to CVS Pharmacy, it was buy one, get one 50% off of their Milani lipsticks, but I had some previously, but I'm going to show you the ones that I use. Chocolate Berries. It looks like this. I actually love this color, Chocolate Berries. The next one is Teddy Bear. Now this can be like a nude for anybody who's looking for like a nude lipstick. I would try out Chocolate Berries from Milani. 
The next one is Sanagria. I love, this was my first lipstick that I purchased for Sanagria. And I love this lipstick right here. I'm so addicted. This is the one that I pick up probably the most out of all of them. And this one is Uptown Mauve. And it looks like this. And the next one is Violet. And it looks like this. And the last one is Red Label. And this is my only red lipstick right now. I've been looking, trying to find a lipstick that, you know, match my complexion. And the other two lipsticks that I got is from Ulta. You know, they were buy one, get one free. And this one is, I think this one is 240. I don't know the name of it, but it's 240. I think this was Chocolate Kisses. And see, this is like another nude. It almost reminds me of Milani's Teddy Bear. And this is 219. I think this was almost Sanagria too. They called it Sanagria. So those are my lipsticks. And I'm gonna show you some nail polishes that I purchased. And here are the nail polishes that I purchased. I love simple colors by the way, because they are affordable and they are cute. So the first one is Berry Charm. So these are some cute fall nail polishes that you can wear. And this one is Ice. I got this one from Walmart. And it is... It doesn't say. But it's six fifty seven. It's Glass of Boredom. Bordeaux. But... And this is another sinful color. And it's called Rebel. But it looks like this. And this one is... Set the mood. And the last but not least of my makeup haul is Vacation Time. And this looks like a nude to me. So that is all that I have purchased when it comes to makeup. Uh, it's a lot to me because I have lots of lipsticks. But I don't have a lot of blushes and foundations and eyeshadow. But I have a lot of lipstick. So if you want to see my lipstick collection, comment down below in the description box. Or on the comments, on the comment section and say you want to see a collection, a lipstick collection video. And I will do that for you guys. So thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye. Peace.